Hey guys, it's Annabelle Birchcastle here and today I am going to be, yes, 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 from this little writing over here, I am going to be telling you guys a lot of crazy spoilers. So before we continue with the video, if you don't want any spoilers for season two or season three, please stop watching the video now. Okay. So, as you know, the end of season two is already upon us. It's just so crazy to me because, um, you know, several months ago it, it took forever to, it felt like it took so long to prepare for it, but it took so short just to make it. So, you know, this will probably be the last series we do in our old series style. More info on that in the video on my main channel. But, um, so... It was really, it's really fun, and we haven't even recorded the finale yet. I'm still waiting on that at the moment. But, by now, it'll probably be uploaded by the time I finish making this or whatever. But, anyways, so, you know, we got all that going on. So, yeah. But, I know you guys, because I always question it myself, are probably wondering if season three is ever going to happen because you know when we made season one I always really wanted to do two and maybe even a three but I was like Ugh, we're probably not even gonna make it to two so let's just take baby steps but then we made two and now we're at the end of two so it's time to start talking about if there's going to be a three so, that's what this video is going to be about, and like I said, before we get into anything too big, click off the video if you don't want spoilers, because there's spoilers, there's a lot of sneak peeks, so, yeah, let's go! Okay, the first thing we need to say is, is it actually happening? Season 3, and yes, it's going to be happening. Um, it's pretty, it's not really a secret, because it's pretty obvious we love making the series and all in Star Stable and it's just a lot of fun. It's just one of those things that making videos and editing them all the time is just so much fun. So I could never just not make the series. Like I could never just I could just not I just I don't know what the word would be, but like I can't. So yeah, season three will be happening. I'm not sure when. We're hoping at least around October, maybe late October at least, but you know, it takes a long time to make series, so we might record it in October of this year, but it might not even come out until next October. We don't know, so we're just taking baby steps, because you know, I I wanted to last, when we were talking about two, I wanted to make it back in October, but I was impatient, so we just did it in August, and now it's almost October, so I guess it kind of works still, you know? But, anyways, so yes, season three is happening. Okay, so the next topic is, what is the story going to be about? I haven't really thought a lot about the story because, as you know, I like to do this, you know, I kind of like to come up with a story and kind of come up with the stuff as I go. Like, I'll make a main story, like, let's just say I thought out all of the whole thing in, in episode three of season two, where, like, I thought they were going to go to Dinosaur Valley, and they were going to, you know, Yulva was going to ha lose the girls in the forest and have voices in her head. But we kind of just went along whatever happened through that, sticking to the original thought as well as adding some of our own things. And I really don't want to plan out every little thing. So, you know, the thought has just kind of been, like, it's only been a couple of months after season two's events, you know, maybe they've, some of the girls have moved on from all of that stuff, some of them stayed, you know, different things, like how in season two, they're all still friends, but they're also off doing some of their own things, like Alice and Lily were on vacation for a while, and so was Emily, you know, they all kind of, you know, did their own thing for a few months, kind of forgot about the missing Claire stuff, I mean, they never forgot about it, but you know, they tried to kind of live like it never happened, but it obviously did. But I'm kind of thinking something like that, where, you know, maybe there's some new characters. 
hopefully, I'm not 100% sure about that, but, you know, that might be a possibility, so, yeah, I haven't really thought much about the story just yet. Okay, so, here are the things I have thought about, and these are, like, the major stuff. I have already thought about the villain. I know, we haven't even, like, discovered the full thing about the villain in season, in season two, Roxanne and all. She's still kind of mysterious. I mean, we know what she looks like. We know what she is now. She's an enemy to them. But we haven't even really seen her in action and what she can do. But that will be coming in the finale. I'm not going to spoil the finale stuff just because that is all meant to be shocking. And it won't be shocking if we know what's going to go on. So, yeah. But I will tell you that Roxanne is not the villain in season three. Roxanne moves on and, you know, goes, oh, you know, she, she leaves for a little while. She might come back every once in a while, but she's not really going to be a main thing. But this time around, there is a really cool villain. At least, I think she's cool. I haven't thought of her exact name yet. I'm kind of still thinking about that, but I know it's going to have an A in her name of some sort. Maybe like Ari or something like that. Something really creepy. So she's like a ghost girl that, you know, she was a ghost her whole life and she didn't really talk to anyone and she didn't really know anyone else. But, you know, all she knew was how to be creepy. So, you know, I'm not thinking about her whole thing yet. You know, like, there's a lot of stuff that goes in the process of the story and the characters. Because, like, in the original thought of season two, Scarlet was going to be related. Scarlet and Alex were going to be sisters, and they were going to be Yova's cousins. And I am kind of glad I scrapped that idea pretty early on, just because I felt like the whole point of Scarlet being, like, without her family involved, not she doesn't have a lot of her family involved growing up, like, I feel like that would just ruin the whole thing. I mean, it would be a very interesting storyline now if we just turned the tables like that, but um, don't worry, I'm not going to just make that an idea. But, you know, there is a certain, you know, there's a process how, you know, you have this certain idea and then you actually have, like, the main thing. I don't know. But there's this whole kind of process that goes with the series and all, so I'm not saying that's exactly the villain yet, that's just an idea I had for a few, you know, for a few thoughts there, but she's going to be a ghost girl, I'm not sure, I probably won't be her because it's been a lot easier to have someone else be her, be the villain, because last time I was almost like every character besides like the three, so... I, I feel like it's just so much easier when you don't have to play 40 characters. Because I still have to play... Um, I still have to play Yulva, Claire, and Sally in Season 2. And I mean, that's hard enough. But, like, imagine before when I had to be... I had to be Elizabeth, too. But luckily now, Maddie's being Elizabeth, so it's a lot easier. But anyways, yeah. But it's always about the thought and everything so let me know what you guys think of that idea for the ghost girl being it because ghosts are a huge obviously a huge thing on the whole Miss Claire series so obviously we have to keep that ghost vibe going on I and mean, I thought about her having like some sort of zombie army which would be pretty cool it would probably take a lot of people but I'm sure we could probably do it so um yeah. And now for the final thing I have to say about season three. The characters. So I'm not exactly sure what will happen in the time between now and whenever we make three. But I am at least hoping that obviously Claire, Scarlet, and Alice will be in it. Um, hopefully Sarah and maybe even Alice, I mean um, Emily will obviously be in there. And maybe even Lily will. But I'm hoping for at least some of the main ones to be there, and we'll add some new ones too, like, we had Alex for a while, she was never actually in any of the season 2 episodes, but she was in the trailers and in the skits and stuff, so 
Alex is kind of, um, you know, she's not like a main character, but she is a background character that is still very important to the story and all. So yeah, that's basically what's going on with her, but as far as characters, I'm not sure who else will be adding. It kind of depends on whoever wants to be in it, because, you know, a lot of our club members like to be in the series and stuff, so. Yeah, it's kind of not decided yet, but at least we know the main characters, because we wanted Scarlet to be in more of the seasons, just because, you know, she's a really important character now. And I feel like the series would just kind of have a chunk missing if she wasn't in there now. And before we end this video, I'm just going to answer the question real quick. Is season 4 happening? I don't know. You know, I, I don't like to really think about, like, super ahead. I mean, season 3 is already super ahead right now. I mean, it's not that far, but... You know, it's like in season one, I thought all the way to like if we were going to do a three or not, and we didn't even know if we were doing a two, so, you know, I like to th just think about it, but I at least know for sure that season three is probably going to happen, and I'm not sure if season four will happen. I hope so. That would be really cool. I think season four will probably be the end of Missing Claire for a while. There might be another series like Missing Claire, maybe with different characters, but the same kind of ghost thing going on. I'm not sure what will happen in the future, but all I know is that it'll definitely be a while until Missing Claire is officially done. And even so, I won't delete this channel or the episodes or anything, of course, and I'll probably still post on here a lot, maybe for like some of my new series. Who knows? So... Yeah, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a big, big, big thumbs up. I'm doing the Pink Rabbits Club outro because why not? Um, make sure to subscribe and click the bell so you're reminded when a new episode, uh, clip, spoiler, whatever, or even more news about season three comes on out. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Spooks out for now. Woo! Stay spooky.